that's what's crazy. We way out in Hawaii. This is when I knew, like, it wasn't a game. Like, mm -hmm. on the field, off the field, wasn't a game. We all the way in Hawaii, and I'm seeing the same females I be seeing back at yeah. home. <laughs> right. I mean, it's still the States, technically. Yeah, bro. You know what I'm saying? saying? Man, this is Hawaii. This shit took me like six thousand hours from Cali, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Right. How you know what I'm saying? Yo, straight up. Welcome back, boy. Hey. Why the fuck, bro? Why the fuck, bro? Why the fuck, bro? That's nothing but methods, baby. Hey, that's what we do. And then pass that rope. That's the, plus the hood. Fuck the hop. He said, oh, you want a shot? I said, shit. Uh, yeah, nigga. Y'all from the city, fuck me now. Y'all from the city. Light it up. Light it up. Light it up. Welcome to you. You probably caught the beginning of it. I don't know. Was you playing like? Did you? Oh. Did they have like targeting when you was playing and stuff like they that? Targeting. They just started. Like, that. Not, yeah, like to my freshman year. Yeah. Nah, like we were right, coming right, sideways, right, right, motherfucker. Right. Like, no, yeah, facts. Like, <laughs> I don't remember. Hey, I don't hey, know. Hey, it, was Florida, it was Florida. Uh, what they playing? Oklahoma. When Matt, who was it? Matt Eaton. No, I was Matt Elon. That was uh, fuck. Elon. Safe. <laughs> He played in the league for a round draft pick. Anyway, that moment he right. killed Major Wright. Oh, Major was Bruh, I'm talking about the up. ball was hanging in the air. Oh, yeah. And yeah. he Punished killed yeah. that young fella on the sideline. You know what they said? Third down! It's incomplete. Uh, incomplete. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> what the fuck so, are you talking about? So, yeah, that's how our practice was, like, <laughs> yeah. in, in, in college. Like, you know what I'm saying? We had some hitters at <laughs> safety. It was like full oh, practice. Yeah, you know yeah. what I'm saying? So Ooh. I can imagine how many hits. Uh, yeah. I done collisions. I done been a part of yeah. even before I got to the league. I know, you know yo, bro. Saying? Like they said, every play, <laughs> so, every football play is a car rig, so bro. Say, oh, and no, I can man, imagine no. back then, bro, that shit was. No, for real. That's when y'all still had two a day, two a day. Oh, yeah, yeah, nah. Two oh, a day, yeah. three a day, special. Like, yeah. We, three. That might say three. Well, a day. three because that's when you have a you have through. a special teams practice in the middle. You know what I'm saying? When he said that's fuck. Hey, that's wild oh, as hell. Because so we you still understand. be all there from Special seven. Seventeen gonna to be going just as hard as offense and defense, but it's gonna be like over. That's the quicker shit. Hey, but that you know what make it only the special teams is out there. Nigga, so everybody me. else in there. Yeah, so me. Me. Yeah, me. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Hey, we, we was out there. I'm that guy. We was, was definitely out there. I was like that for and I got a couple do regular years. Practice. <laughs> I was trying to get my ass off special uh, teams. Three days. <laughs> so you played special Jeez. teams in college. Yeah, that's Bro, definitely playing special teams I in college. I was number five, L five, R five, all Ooh, that shit. Oh yeah, see, wedge buster. Right. That's Ooh. when you can still lock arms and shit. Ooh, yeah, I had a piece yeah. of that too. But that's why I'm like, yeah, I'm great. Yeah, they, I went out there. We had, that. Uh, we uh, had, uh, they put uh, linemen back there and come yeah. down. It'll be us four. Oh yeah, yeah. Lock, lock on, on show. All and three hundred pounds right there by him. Somebody like him coming out. Two of them. We about to fuck his ass up. Go <laughs> like, cow. He looking for a Caesar salad <laughs> yeah. with extra croutons <laughs> on the sideline. Hey, that's that's, that's when you get. That's when you get them non scholarship players lying their ass up right there. Hey, yeah, you run to that bitch with all your might. We gonna get this five star to cut off your back. <laughs> <laughs> we gonna make the tackle. Get this five star to come off your back. Oh me. Nah, you ready it, though? Oh, <laughs> me. It was. It was live. It but was, see, I ain't never touched this. I probably been like. Five special team plays in college, and one of them was. Oh, you look like it was just. As a freshman, out. I played special teams. Then I, see, I know, started my first had, day on campus. I started. I didn't have oh, that. So you, I'm yeah, out there all defense plays. So they, they ain't had to put me. I ain't put no no. That's nice. Yeah, no, yeah, that was def, that's what? definitely nice. That shit went to my head for a minute. For, it, 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 it went have to. Too. It would have to. It, it did. I stayed straight out of high line. school. You going right on campus? Right on campus. Man, move. And I didn't go to school till August. Mm, right, I had to stay at home and do some. So like you the missed computer. the whole summer. I missed the whole summer workout. Oh, you wild! I got the training camp. Like, and you got the school and started. I got the training uh, camp. Niggas, two, I was, two weeks niggas after the training camp hot. started. Two, like the first day on. You can look that shit up. First day, bro. I go out there, bitch. We was just in helmets. I'm out there, bitch. Tripping. I'm playing safety. Tripping. Backpedal. I fall, nigga. I'm dropping passes, nigga. I was Ooh. nervous that day, but then I told the coach, hey, I uh, wanted to a little break. I broke down. Uh, uh, Thig I was like, hey, Coach, man, my, that shit ain't gonna never happen again. He was like, yeah, all right, nigga. We go to practice, they ain't play, do nothing practice. I still did the whole time watching. In the scrimmage, threw my ass in that bitch, snapping. Went Let off. go. Picking shit, knocking niggas out. Let go. TFL from safety, nigga, I'm snapping. You just go on like, like, forget this. And we had a game in like two weeks, nigga. No, I was just like, one's everything. When did you move the linebacker? 
After my freshman year. Yeah, see. You got one year to rock out safety. One year, but I was all SEC, all American, all that shit. All right, we'll be a linebacker. We're going crazy. Now, don't get to... I know, the people that they... That, now that they want to get the best in. players on the field. Like, if they, you know what I mean? So that's what they were thinking. So that's what they were So we had a dude that was coming off an of injury. Mike McNeil, he was coming back at safety. And we had Zach Ethers. And then it was going to be me. So it wasn't going to be no rotation. They just put me the linebacker. We only had Josh Bynes, who's still in the league right now. And so you was probably the more physical of the three, of the nah, other two. Yeah, I, I was the, the more athletic. So I was taking the tight end, guarding the tight ends and shit. Right. You know what I'm saying? And I'm playing the weak side, the back side of everything, Craig on the front. That's you know, what so I was at. Same, yeah, same, same situation. Yeah, yeah. So just had to find my way through all that shit. But yeah, I never had to touch the special teams, though. Nah, they started, I played special the teams in the league, too. My, I was the first round pick. And um, shit, you don't hear that often with first round teams. picks. It wasn't. Special teams. But like back then, yeah. people wasn't just coming in and getting on the field. True. That's a lie. Because shit. LeVar, I'm the my draft class was LeVar, LeVar Arrington, Brian Dog. Erlacher, Dog. Um, God damn. John Abraham, God he damn. was drafted oh. at outside linebacker. Uh, this dude Rob Morris, who went to BYU, played for the Colts, and then I was the fifth in the it was the fifth in that first round. I was the fifth linebacker in that first round. Oh, y'all took five so, linebackers in the first. They took five. Line, God damn! Draft. They drafted five linebackers. It was, it was different. Bro, different type of football draft. back then. Bro, different type of yeah. football, boy. It was still high formation. Yeah, I'm trying to tell you, power. Fullbacks are going up? second round type shit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, like if I was playing now, like now, it's this this easy. This yeah. easy. Easy. That's like playing safety now. Who would you compare yourself to now if you like to play in the league? Now? Now? Um, I don't know. Um, <laughs> I like you know too. what? They don't... I would say... I know I like I like Bobby Wagner's game. He's been around. Uh, I like yeah. the dude in San Francisco, Fred. Fred Warner. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um... A couple other cats, man, that I'll be watching. Uh, like I, I like my man down in. Um, I got my man Devin White down in. Um, oh yeah, Tampa. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You know Devin be snapping. And obviously, um, the OG that played next to him, Levante. Right. You yep. know what I'm saying? Yep. Mm-hmm. So there's a bunch of cats out there that got game. But I don't know, man. I, I, I really, I don't, I, I really don't know. I don't, I don't watch the game like There's that because I really never watched. When I'm watching my, you know, when I yeah. was playing, I never, I've never really watched myself. So you watch film, but I don't sit there like... Because you ain't have the iPad, like, though. Like, you know what I mean? You ain't have the iPad okay, on that yeah, right, like, yeah, yeah, like, that's I know, I you know, You got that like, iPad, boy. They put that shit on real fast, boy. Yeah. What the fuck I fuck up? What they gonna be talking about tomorrow? Right, because that's all you thinking about. You ain't thinking <laughs> right, about, ooh, right. that... I mean, you gonna know your plays you know that your you play, made, yeah, yeah, but, but you, you ain't gonna sit right. there and yeah. be like... Man, you might, you know what I'm saying? You'd be like, oh man, that's cold. But you know, you trying yeah. to like, right. it's not, it's part of the process. You yeah, know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, so like when I watch now or when I watch you play, I was like, man, buddy go hard. He got energy. Mm-hmm. He got, I like when he do that. Like I like, um, I like Lumberjack uh, and Wesley Williams. Well, yeah, um, yeah, 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 dog. Because yeah, I know yeah, yeah. Hey, he played with my man in Denver, mm-hmm. and I knew him when he was when he was first yeah. coming in the yeah. league. He played up here at Kentucky. So, you know, you see um, certain players and stuff like that. And then uh, I felt he was a, a really good, he was a great um, Titans linebacker. He held it down. See, that's what sure. I be trying to tell people. See, like, not a lot of people outside of, of uh, LaGrange, Georgia, where he's from, or University of Kentucky or Nashville, never, like, don't know who Wesley Williard is. But that motherfucker was a dog. Yeah, was not for sure. Small <laughs> linebacker. Good night. Well, get on the motherfucker ass. But see, people, when they ever think about, like, him like that, because they don't even know. So they know right. about the... This is the big name Bobby Wagner. Like, nah, that nigga still the code. Nah, Bobby uh, Wagner. He man, busy. Listen, Bobby Wagner whooped our ass in college. <laughs> we what moved. school he went to? Utah. Oh, okay. Utah State. Utah State. Utah State. Man, they came to Auburn, boy. Niggas was sweating that bit. We thought we were about to lose. Utah State. Man, man listen, they almost gave it to our ass at Auburn, too. That's tough. Tough. <laughs> That's tough. So we played in two different eras, right? So who was some running backs during your era? Ooh, boy, you must like... been looking at my notes. I had some few. Uh, <laughs> you can shoot. shoot it back at me. I mean, you know, I, you know, I, I run it back. <laughs> we just vibing. Yeah, yeah, right, yeah. Right. yeah, yeah. College, yeah. college wise, or what league? Nah, in the league. Or say shady now. That man, my <laughs> list. Oh, shady made you go viral. Shady gave you crazy work. <laughs> <laughs> you know what he gave that crazy That's my word, dog. Bro. Listen, he gave I ain't never get to play. I ain't never catch shady. I can't lie. I'm glad I didn't. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Well, I'm about to say. <laughs> well, <laughs> me neither. I'm about to say I had to go. I'm gonna have to go with college because you know I'm like I said in the league on special teams. So right. I give you them special team dogs off real. But 
college though, because these all these motherfuckers still made it to the league. Fucking first of all, we just start with LSU. Nigga, I had Alfred Blue <sighs> made it to the league. Jeremy yeah, Hill yeah. made it to the league. Shit, they had who else in there? A whole bunch of other motherfuckers. But then oh, we got Trent Richardson, clean, Mark man. Ingram, you know, Kenyon yeah, Drake. Yeah. Uh, right. uh, fucking that Arkansas, they had a. Uh, 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 we uh, play against McFadden. Now, or McFadden oh, was after, gone. Mick, no, McFadden had a two point that came out to him. Now, run just like mm-hmm. it. Now, Davis, right. fucking mm-hmm. dog, wouldn't obviously wasn't no first yeah, round. He yeah, wasn't yeah. like second round pick. He was a dog though. Right, play against him, shit. Uh, at South Carolina, dude, they got hurt. Uh, Marcus Lattimore. Oh, Lattimore, it was nice. Dog, yes, you did. Shit. I didn't play against him, but. Yeah, I didn't it's, play college wise, but yeah, I seen them all. Like I, I was like, like you said, being plenty. out there on that field, I was out there all the time. Right on. Like, I got the, I want to say, like the second most tackles in the last twenty years. T- you know, since I was just out there. Yeah, you gonna make tackles you if you're out there. You, you out there. You gotta <laughs> be out there. You gotta be active. So I just seen a whole bunch of running backs coming through that time period, uh, from the first rounders to undrafted motherfuckers that still make it. Shit, I'm trying to think. Like, it just, it's been some dogs, bro. It's been some yeah, dogs. Now nah, you play football. That's what I tell anybody, man. You play football at every level, man. It's gonna, people are going to come through. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. They're going to they're gonna, they're gonna challenge your competitive spirit. You know what I'm saying? They're going to, like, challenge your, your physicality. They're going to really, you know, that's what the whole game of football is about. You know what I'm saying? And that's what I always, um, you know, just appreciate having you know, we don't have too many football conversations, but obviously yeah. this is what we're doing right now. So that's why, you know, I like to, you know, I know all them names. So I watched it from, watch it. Um, obviously, um, I, those names, I played against a bunch of them cats when they yeah. got to the league. You know what I'm saying? Um, so, you know. But, yeah, but Sean gave me some that crazy work. But it wasn't just me, bro. <laughs> Listen, bro. He said it wasn't just me, <laughs> though. We were, playing, we were playing, like, a little rat <laughs> coverage. And it was, like, fourth and, like, three or some shit. And you know, rat, you can be off. I'm like, fuck that. I ain't finna be off too far. Right. It's shady now. Right. Mm-hmm. Like, I'm like, I'm gonna make sure I'm in arm this just in case they throw him the ball. This Wait, you had man to man? Yes, but I had, but I'm sitting <laughs> off though. Cause I had help <laughs> inside. Oh, I had help shit. inside. Okay. It was the red cover. It was like, hey, this is not racist. It was Indian coverage. You know, so you like got that blanket right. or the tent right. over. So boom, mm-hmm. playing like that. So I know I got inside help. So I'm heavy outside. Man, this motherfucker Josh Allen still throw it to him. I'm right there. Why would you throw it to him? That's the first thing I'm thinking. He still right. throw it. Right. So don't, rookie don't care. He still throw it. Don't care. I'm just like, finna go th- run up to make the tackle, bro. This motherfucker stabbed me outside. I <laughs> jump, man, that motherfucker. Stab, go back inside. Hey, that's Here why come. Josh Allen threw it to him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> who was that? Who was that? Who was that? Who was that? <laughs> who was that? <laughs> don't care. Don't then, care. Then, okay, then the pursuit come. Okay, I'm like, cool, rat right there. He inside, so boom, rat come. He shake the shot of rat. <laughs> Jr. come, shake the shot of Jr. I'll come back Ooh. immediately. Boom, I get up. Boom, I'm there. This motherfucker hit, shake, he's shaking Man. somebody else, so he just shook me again. <laughs> <laughs> nice, nice shaking somebody Damn, else. He's nice bro. like that, though. He shook me again. He's definitely I ain't nice never like got that. did like that, bro. And he wasn't even looking at me that time. <laughs> Be like that. Same. I like. I've never had nobody like even like them little running backs in college that you know be shifty in the open space. See, I just asked you who was the nicest, and I nowhere on divine. I would say no, okay, now like, mm. nice like that. If you want to get saucy with a motherfucker, yes. nowhere on divine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I seen that okay. nigga in the hole. Guess what I did? Grab the shit out of his ass. You're not going nowhere. Hold <laughs> on, <laughs> what? Grab a jersey. He hurt somebody off. Of yeah. Adam Heron, bro. My bad, Adam. But he shook Adam so hard, bro, in that, a, in that B gap on a run play. Bro, talking about one, two step so smooth, and Adam just did. Oh, <laughs> no mm. cap touchdown. Damn. Yeah, you can look that up. It was Damn. the rain game in Auburn, two thousand nine. I was still playing safety. Damn. Mm. Yeah, <laughs> that motherfucker did that. So I'm be it. I just I don't know about it. That's on college bro. There's been some two minute dog I done seen. I done played against them boys. Be different. Uh-huh. But for you, you come in a whole different era. Of fucking. Like, but can you believe, bro? Two about like three white boys in here. I said, I said something about Mike Allstott. They looked around like they ain't never heard of him. They ain't never heard of Mike Allstott. It was John Lynch too. <laughs> they talking about who? He I said, said bro, what the fuck going on there? That was funny. John Lynch. <laughs> they ain't even white on RB. I ain't <laughs> funny. We gonna clip that <laughs> shit up. John Lynch. <laughs> Niggas did not move. Y'all don't know who John Lynch is? <laughs> I mean, yeah, the name right. is forever. I'm not gonna remember it. I'm Bro. drunk. Are you sick? Really you the get, white guy? I've sit here and drank this. You time. the I'm white guy, John Man. You don't know who John Lynch? Bro, get the fuck out of here. Y'all white cars have been revoked for today.
<laughs> bro, that shit took me out. I was out the wrong way, bro. But yeah, tell me who like you didn't seen that that you just said like they 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 were like that. Um, uh, Adrian Peterson for sure. Ooh. AP. You no, know, I'll say like anybody that. Um, That's crazy. Well, I said you know like um, Edwin James was in my division. I see mm-hmm. him twice a year. Shit, the bus. Uh, Fred Taylor. Um, Corey Dillon was a dog. Dog. Um, shit. Man, Brandon Jacobs was a motherfucker. Oh, my God. He ran hard. He ran angry. He ran mean. Like, he was trying to, hey, that he nigga. trying to do this to you and shit. He trying to hump you out the <laughs> truck your ass. Right, right. Hey, that nigga. That's my dog. Crazy, that man, boy taking you a little extra on right. top. Yeah, man. Um, nah, just like you said, man, uh, it was, I, I got the opportunity. I shoot. Uh, Marshall Falk, I played against my rookie. Yeah. Ever. Marshall Falk was, man, it's crazy. You know, because you like, dang, Marshall Falk, that's my dude. And now yeah. you playing against yeah. like, Say hey, Marshall Falk, do it your ass. Yeah, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Marshall Falk don't give a fuck about your ass. Like, <laughs> I oh, think that's what, but that's what she what you be saying. That's like the second, third time. He's like, motherfucker out there trying to fuck you up. But what? That's what I'm trying yeah, to tell yeah. him. He asked me, like, I don't know, when was a while ago, you asked me about some shit like that. Yeah. I, like, I don't know what we were talking about, but you asked, like, do hey, y'all like go out there be like trying to, not, yeah. You don't intensely go out and hurt, but you like, yeah, I'm finna run through this nigga face. Oh, yeah, yeah, like, oh yeah. It, 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 was it, like it was something like that. It was probably something like, like your, something your like homeboy that. or something like that. Yeah, yeah. that's what it was. That's what it was. That's yep. what it was. If that was your homie, you know. Yeah, you still gonna get him. Oh, yeah. yeah. And we gonna start judging. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Sure. So, I told you, man, man now, he a year older than me, so we played against each other like, set like a Three times in the league, and like, yeah, I'm not. I like he said, I ain't gonna like try and purposely try and hurt, but within the, the action of look, if he throwing, if he about, about like this, oh, and I, I'm gonna eat all this stuff. I'm gonna eat it all up, boy. Let me get that. Let me you get that. Sure. Right. Nah, we ain't never had that, but like, he ain't never beat me. So now being yeah, retired, hey, he, he, he ain't never beat me. Either. <laughs> he ain't never beat me either. Yeah, that's crazy. Nah, but that's right? what I'm saying. That's crazy. Like, oh, that's yo, crazy. He, like at least as homies when we get around, <laughs> yeah. driving drinks, kids yeah. and family around, like. He like, you know what, our athletes, we all talk shit. Mm-hmm. He can't, he can't say nothing. And I scored on their ass and threw it in the in the stands. What, what that fine? <laughs> How much was that fine? Five Did they have five bands? Damn. Oh, just, okay, that's just what they What was y'all sock fine? Y'all had, I know y'all had to sock. Like twenty five hundred. Yeah, it's still yeah, the same. That's crazy. Sock fine is still just the uh, craziest bro, thing word to me. You get a shirt fine, man. Yeah. Five, five of them things. That used to like piss me off, like yeah. when you, um, like before the game, because that when we was playing, like you know when you stretching pregame, yeah, like, out there you by yourself, uh-huh. they'll let you, you know yeah, 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 they'll they'll check you out, yeah. and they'll be like. You ain't even, first of all, you ain't even dressed yet. You ain't yet. even dressed yet. You just out you there just in your own shit. swag. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Like, yeah. Tell me, oh, you got to pull your side. I'm like, look, I told the dude, I'm like, look, man, it was a big game. So I was like, you talk to my equipment manager about that shit, man. Don't come <laughs> while I'm talking <laughs> to Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Don't tell you that. Right. You're trying to fuck your vibe up. Talk to me about some to... socks, man. Right. Yeah. Man, I'm what? trying to play. <laughs> Then when you come back in for like before you for, go back yeah, out, yeah, you, yeah, 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 and he yeah. started telling my fucking equipment yeah. manager, Joey will be like, Keith, they want you to pull your side, man. Fuck that shit. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's, hey, that's, no, ex- that's, that's exactly how that conversation I used to tell Joey the same shit. Joey, that's guess exactly what? how that conversation goes. It got to the point where I'm like, Joey, He's like, yes, I know. Right. He just Fuck gotta him. tell you. On me. He just gotta tell you. I gotta say it. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. I, yeah. I, I gotta shout tell out you. to my man Joey. Shout out to Joey, <laughs> right. but yeah, but <laughs> what was the point of time that you knew, like, all right, at linebacker, like, I, I'm, I can make it to the league? Um, well, I'm about to be first round. Ooh. At linebacker? I mean, because oh. you was that linebacker, because yeah. were you thinking that same way your freshman year, though? Nah, so. So I, I thought I thought yes, my red shirt freshman year, I thought like that because my man, like I said, I was sharing time with a fifth year senior, 
and he got free agency to the Vikings. Okay. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, oh, well, I'm only, I'm about to be a soft. I'm going to at least be there. So right. I'm, I'm working right. on my back pedal. I'm, <laughs> like, I'm working on every, I'm studying Phil. You know what I'm saying? And they're like, wrong, we're going to move you to linebacker. This. So it's like, man, like I said, I just wanted to get on the field. But it wasn't, it was... So my first, my sophomore year, redshirt sophomore year, I played weak side linebacker. Mm -hmm. And then my frat, my junior year, they moved me to middle linebacker. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? So by then, we played the <laughs> University of Tennessee the first year. No, uh, yeah, the first game of the season in 97, and this is the um, national oh, championship. That's the year they went ahead. Yeah, and uh, it was a, you know, it was a back and forth game. Matter of fact, what we, was the game? Was it, in it was in Syracuse. Oh, oh I, I was like, actually, you know you, what I'm saying? You yeah, so, um, you know, the Jamal Lewis, T. Mark, like, mm -hmm. you know, they had a peerless Jeez. price. Yeah, Al Wilson. Boy. Hell yeah. You know, they had them dogs, dogs you know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. But, like, to yeah. be real, in college, man, you... You don't know nothing no, you, about, about, yeah, about you nothing. Really know. Like you just, we just you got them. Yep. Like you know what I'm saying. We didn't know how nice they was. They didn't know. They, you know what their coach tell you. Oh, mm -hmm. they got a nice quarterback, Donovan McNabb, and they got mm -hmm. this right. person. But you don't know they, they other players mm -hmm. that they ain't hey, getting so talked about. Hey, sweet, yeah. Yeah. Different though. Hey, sweet. I, I feel like we got the videos, but they ain't have all I was, the videos. I, was gonna say, all I, I guess it was, because like yeah, nowadays, right. like kids, we know who they going up against. No, oh, yeah, we sure. do, but Sometimes, it's like especially yeah. the first game of the season. So like they SEC, right. and we Big East, yeah. so we ain't. It's not like we it's familiar like with. You right. know what I mean? So right, you can right, say right. to Jamal Lewis. They didn't even have film on him because he was coming out of high school. Damn, y'all had to part. beat that boy. And yo, they got the ball. I'll never forget, Fresh man. J. Lou, like, yo, they ran I formation. You know what I'm saying? I'm, oh my my first game at linebacker, middle linebacker. I'm like, damn. <laughs> that is the, the J. Lou is bigger than Sean Bryson, his fullback. <laughs> and you got that big line up seven yards I'm away. I'm like, damn, he a freshman in my head saying, huh? <laughs> but yeah, nah, I would say like, cause that was a good game. Like they beat us, you know, like a little phantom pass interference call at the mm. end. And, oh yeah. Um, and then I balled out that year. Like we went to Michigan the next game. I had like 22 tackles in the big house and I always wanted to Ooh, go to Michigan. Yeah. And then I was at line so we went off yeah. um, in Michigan. So I started to put mm. my game together my junior year. So I got on the map. Then and then my senior year, I just had to hold it down. You know what yeah. I'm saying? So, you know, I would say my junior year, I knew, because like I told you, man, my roommate, he was a good mentor, just for like college. He's like, you know, why are you hanging out with this? You know, just, yeah, just trying to look out. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I'm Need saying? That. Like yeah. lock Need in that. type shit. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And um, you know, and then I had other upperclassmen and people around me. And then, you know, my boys, we just all got right. Yeah, Everybody right. that was on the same path, got we right, just got yeah. right. Because even in college, just like in um, high school, not everybody is rocking on the same path. For you sure. know what Definitely I'm saying? Right. Definitely Definitely not. Not. But, but in, you know, in college, we all athletes, right. we in the same circle. Right. But then it starts to, you know, you could tell if we go into the league, they might not be going right. to the league. So they might go out. Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, mm -hmm. every night. You know, every yeah, night. You know what I mean? Because they just there to get their education now, do their thing on Saturday and go to practice, but their football goals ain't as big as ours. So. All right, right. right. Real, real name question, bro. Have you ever got ran over? <laughs> Come on, um, talk to us. No, nah, nah, in the league? In the league? In the league. Oh man, they're gonna have to find a tape on that. Yes. Um, but you know what? Yes. I haven't got I... ran over, but I made some business decisions. Oh, you got you know what I'm saying? Nah, not like that. But right. like, you know, football is all about angles. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Angles and there's physics and all that shit is involved. So right. like, you know, if I got yeah, like, I'm not going to let nobody get all this. You know what I'm saying? Right, so, I'm like, here, but, I'm yeah, here. if we got to go head up, we're going to have to go head up. But, like, in open field in the league, the running back, if he going to try and, for example, he, like, Corey Dillon was a dude, he going to get low. Yeah. He going to definitely try and give you that. Brandon <sighs> Jacobs, the same thing. Mm -hmm. You know, you got to mix it up, man. Sometimes you got to cut, cut them low. Yeah, and yeah, then yeah. now they like, oh, you bitch ass. Yeah, 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 yeah. hot. Oh, you punk. Yeah. You supposed to be a hitter. All right. Yeah, and then next time they come head, around. Yeah. Yeah. Pop, you catch them up high. So, yeah. you know, like, I, I've never put myself in that position. But now sometimes you can't help when you're in the hole. Like, you like, come off a block like, and then yeah, just, like, oh, she's a running back. Nah, right yo, there. you know what? 
I got, yeah, yeah. I, um, what's his name, man? Oh man, what's his name, man? He went to the. He was uh, he was Ladanian Thomas since. Oh, after Burner Turner. Oh, okay. I thought you were talking about a fullback. Nah, oh, man. Lorenzo Neal, he played fullback. with me. He played that with But see, even then, out. like, so he played in Cincinnati. He played with, like, but, like, even on the lead blocks. Mm -hmm. Man, like, it ain't, for me, it ain't no tough guy competition. You know uh -huh. what I'm saying? I'm just trying to fill the hole and do my yeah. job. Right. So on certain, um, like, you got to throw different pitches. Like, I'll get skinny, yeah. and then they want to try and collapse, come in more. Now I'm going to mash you into the hole. I'm yeah, always yeah. trying to keep myself free. I ain't never trying to give up one for one. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to make the play if I can, you know what I'm saying? Thanks. But yeah, after Bernard Turner, like, he ran my back over. Like, I was in, he was like, I got spun around and he just good. <clears throat> so what? Oh, and, I, and, I, and I was like this on the field. Like, oh, <laughs> so yeah, after Bernard Turner, yeah, he gave Damn. me that business. He, he ran me, he ran over my, my back. I don't even know. <laughs> what was that 2003 year like going to the Pro Bowl? Like, what was that year? Uh, um, how many it, tackles you have? Uh, one one eighty. Yeah, it was cool, man. It was cool. Like I felt like so I didn't know how the league worked. You know that year I came. I so I was a first round pick, but I ain't start till my third year. Mm -hmm. You know I told you it was all in yeah. my class. Them boys have been to the Pro Bowl, All Pro, all that. I'm like, mm -hmm. damn, I'm out here like a scrub. Yeah. Man, you know what I mean, so when I got on the field, like I ain't come off. Like I mm -hmm. played 127 straight games. Like you know what I'm saying. So. You know, Mr. that's my body of work. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Right. Um, so the, that was my second year starting because um, the first year I started, I didn't go to the Pro Bowl. We went all the way to the AFC Championship game. Mm -hmm. And you played here, so, you know, it's small market. Yep, the market was yep. even smaller then. Mm -hmm. So we ain't getting no love. You know, how mm -hmm. we, we started off one and four and then finished uh, – Made 11 and 5 and made right. the AFC Championship game. Ain't nobody make the Pro Bowl. You know what I mean? I had 180 Damn. that year, too. You know what I'm saying? Damn. So, yeah. you know. That shit be happening. It's straight hate, right? That shit be happening. That's definitely, but that's how. But <laughs> so so it was cool, though, man. It was cool, you know, because um, that was my only year going, to getting that opportunity. So it was cool that I got that opportunity, yeah. man. Um, I, I, my brothers came, um, my boys came. You that was know back when saying? we were always in Hawaii. Oh yeah, we was going to Hawaii. Yeah, we was yeah. on the little school. Yeah, yo, it was dope. Yeah, it was dope. Right. We was talking about the New York hip hop. So my boys used to, we'll have a little situation out there. My New York homies, um, and do a do a party like mm -hmm. DJ Clue with DJ it. Ooh, and like you know what I'm saying. Yo, saying. so that's what's crazy. That's what's crazy. We way out in Hawaii. This is when I knew, like, it wasn't a game. Like, mm -hmm. on the field, off the field, it wasn't a game. We all the way in Hawaii, and I'm seeing the same females I be seeing back at yeah. home. <laughs> right. I mean, it's still the States, technically. Yeah, bro. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, but this is Hawaii. Hawaii. This shit took me, like, six thousand hours from Cali, bitch. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> right. like, how you need them bills, man? Like, yeah, straight up. How you get how here? You say, how you and I ain't say nothing, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I just, like, that's when I knew it was real. Because, yeah. you know, Miami is one thing. Vegas is one thing. Yeah, LA yeah, is yeah. one thing. Yeah. You know. Oh, wow. But yeah, Hawaii, Hawaii, like, yeah. Hawaii, like. You was invested. I'm like, right. okay. Right. I'm like, okay. <laughs> All right. You, you know what I'm saying? So, but now nah, I was cool, man. Warren Moon, the OG, used to always throw a party out there. Yeah. He had a nice little situation. And, like, all the fellas. It was also, I mean, um, Pro Bowl was dope. Because, um. It was way out there. <laughs> like I said, I don't know how. Hey, people got there and it, yeah. and it just happened. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I ain't yeah, asked no questions. I'm just, just here to party, baby. Yeah, hey, hey, oh, hey, 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 practice was mad cool. You yeah. go out to practice in flip flops. Tony Dungy was <laughs> our, um, co you go practice flip flops in the Pro Bowl visor, your, your jersey. Right. You, you just go <laughs> walk three. You know what I'm saying? You can't blitz, you know, four on three. I think special teams is probably like, Probably seemed like they was having the most fun because that's full tilt. You got to protect yeah, you yourself gotta, out yeah, there. Yeah, you, <laughs> you got to. So, what? Yeah. Like, yeah, you see, yeah. everything else is some bullshit. It's definitely changed now, but like, oh, my cash used to be out there trying to win. So. Yeah. Yeah, but I, I, I liked it, man. It was a great experience. Now, we played for a similar, uh, same coach, Jeff Fisher. 
Right, yeah. Nah, I got some stories I didn't tell the raw room about Jeff Fish and just... Yeah, nah, you know, we all could. Nah, I'm if talking about this is a fun, fun yeah. shit, like him just cracking if over a whole thing him, of yeah, a yeah. whole thing of beers out there, or the time he sent the whole draft class that he traded the Washington, uh, at the time, skins for. It was like eight of them motherfuckers. He traded their ass, so they got RG3. We ended up beating the shit out of their ass. <laughs> he uh, sent all of them to the corn toss. They're like all rookies and shit. He sent them where? <laughs> to the corn toss. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, <laughs> nah. Fuck with them. So that, wow. Yeah, but so that's what I'm saying. Like, I got story like, Jeff, when, um, so, you know, the Music City Miracle, right? Mm -hmm. So we played Buffalo up there the first game Monday night that year in 2000, my rookie year. He sent... Like Dyson, Wachek, Lorenzo, Neal, everybody a part of that play out there for the coin toss up there in Buffalo. Jeff, hey man, Jeff used to do he good like that. Hey, man, man, like, penny, he's man. Man. He's he's shit. Man. He's funny. I like the energy. Yeah. Hey, he was a good player, coach, yeah, bro. I, good people, I, I man. love being uh a part of anything he had going. Like, we we yeah, weren't nah. winning when we was in uh St. Louis, but it was always fun to come to work. I yeah, think. now you're going to make it light, man. You know what I'm saying? I think that sometimes, and you know, just OG talking, like sometimes his loyalty, um, in my opinion, his mic, in my I personal opinion, you, you know what I'm saying? Um, yeah, there we go. Um, you know, that's coach's loyalty, you mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? And it always, it's, you see it all the time, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So, you know, I think as a player, sometimes, you know, um, not sometimes. I think I'm just talking about one time. I ain't have too much fun my last year here, but that's all. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's I was gonna I'm ask saying. you. So like you you came to Tennessee right right after the, they went to Super Bowl. Yeah. yeah. What was it? What was it like in Nashville? The feeling locked room? I mean, like, I mean, what, what was the energy like? You you coming in and they just got done, you know. So that's you know what, man? Like, so my last my last year at Syracuse, um, my last game was here at the Music City Bowl. That's off. That's and I, crazy. And I had, yeah. yeah. That's crazy. And I had the record. They told me to, it just got broke like a couple years ago in the overtime game, but I had the record for the most the tackles. But yeah, man, you know, they was grown ass men. They just lost the Super Bowl by yeah. half a yard. So for yeah. them, it was unfinished business. And I mm -hmm. think that was a great situation to come into. They was, they was um, work. Yeah, you know what yeah. I'm saying? And Nashville was like, yo, you trying to get out of here any chance you get. Like, because it was nothing, bro. Like, yeah. you know, you go down second half, you go to the underground, you got like bar in Nashville, you used to go out to uh, uh, Outer Limits. Um, and Silverados on that's an experience. Yeah. Silverados yeah, Silverado. on a Sunday. Was uh, Limelight around? Limelight. Limelight was around. Limelight, Limelight definitely was Limelight. like Limelight. Steve Limelight McNair had a um Steve McNair had a um a, a, a club called the Red Carpet. It was yeah. it was cold. It was um right there off um West End. I was pretty, but it was like you know Roof Chris and Flemings was like the, and the, the biggest, Palm yeah. was like the steakhouse. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But so Palm I say nice. a lot, but like it just make you just focus on football. football. Yeah. But what was cool? It's an hour and a half flight, pretty much like from to get back to New York. It was like maybe oh, like yeah. a little less than two hours. You get to Miami, you get anywhere mm -hmm. was centrally located enough yeah. that like all right, yeah, when you got the there. opportunity. Trying to get on that internet yeah, and get yeah, some yeah, get, get out of here, but they, yeah, so it was cool, man. Like uh, it, it, it gave me a work ethic. They taught me how to be a pro. That team taught me what like being in the NFL was like, how to be professional. And then even when it got to the point where I was like in my fifth, sixth year, or whatever, and the team wasn't wasn't as good or whatever, we was going through a transition. I had learned how to be a leader. I didn't realize that I had learned how to be a leader. Back then, because shoot, Javon Curse was gone, Samari Rowe was gone, mm -hmm. Steve McNair was gone, there Eddie, everybody was gone. You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? And they had paid me on defense, and it was like me, Albert Haynesworth, like you know what I mean. Albert was young, mm -hmm. wilding, like Whoa, not wilder, focused, bro. like yeah. you know what I'm saying. And we had like some pieces, but um, you know, I think playing with that team, I learned a lot of things in those first two years. That when it was. Nobody around, and it was like, yo, if you want to win, you got to step up 
and be a leader. Like, I ain't trying, I'm just trying to get out there and do my job, man. Everybody's mm -hmm. pros, you should know how to do your shit. You know what I mean? But it don't work like that. You yeah, know what I mean? Yeah. So if you want to have success, uh, especially in the NFL, because if you ain't winning the NFL, you ain't shit. You know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. Like, you just out there yeah. collecting a check, having a good time. You ain't gonna be out there long. That. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. They gonna find a way, like, yeah. to, to push you on. So, yeah. um, you know, I, I remember one time, you know, Jeff Fisher, he called me in his office. I, I don't remember what it was about, but he was like, look, man, this team, you either, this team gonna go with you one way or another. It's like, you either gonna bring them up or we just, we gonna go down, you know what I'm saying? So within doing that, that made me hold other people accountable. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, I'll, but <clears throat> before you could do that, you got to be check on yourself. point. Yeah, you, you, you know what I'm saying? Right so yeah. like that, mm -hmm. that made me be on point because I had people holding me. I knew how to hold people accountable. So if we watching film, be like, yo, not going to say nothing, but it'll be like, if we keep seeing it, hey, Bates, man, make sure you're in your gap, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because yes. I'm going to make sure I'm in my gap. Because before you know I can tell you, yeah, 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 sure yeah, yeah, right. yeah. You know what I'm saying? Right. And it ain't going to be, it ain't going to be nothing. Now, I ain't going to lie. There have been some younger players as I got older where, like, it was to the point, bro, like, I told you I played 127 straight mm -hmm. games. You know what yeah. I'm saying? So that's a lot of snaps. Yeah, so yeah. it's like, I could look up on the Jumbotron or just ask, yo, where was you? Was you here? Yeah, and then like put it together. Yeah, yeah, and I'm like, yeah. man, what, you know? Yeah. It's like, you know, man, right, exactly. me. Exactly. Exactly. Who the fuck you You gave up this fucking x one. God damn. Yo, you know what I'm saying? Yep. And then, like, we get, like, because, uh, you know, and then it'd be whatever. Then we get on the film. We see it. I'm not going to It's over. Mm -hmm. That that happened yeah, then. Yeah, that yeah, happened yeah, yesterday. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. We ain't going to argue about it on the sideline, but motherfucker, you wrong. Yeah. Right. But we ain't going to come back to it. If you're going to sit here and be a baby, that's yeah. cool. You can have that. Yeah. We gonna, everybody going to see on film because everybody saw us just having... You know, it's we tried to talk yeah. about so, cause, it. Yeah, because oh, everybody yeah. going to remember that. Oh, yeah, oh, me. Go, all going back and forth. Yeah. All right, pull that film up. Yeah. Team meeting in front and of everybody. Gotta, you don't got to say nothing. Yeah. So, like, you know what I'm saying? And if I'm wrong, then I'm wrong. But I'm not going to be wrong. Yeah, facts. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so. Bro. He's like, I ain't going to be wrong, though. Got to know your shit. Got to know your shit. Best thing yeah. about, like, the linebacker, bro, that, they, well, I feel like for you, your, your time, anybody before this, and then I don't know about now, because safety's running a lot of shit for teams right, nowadays. Yeah, right. but linebackers with the quarterbacks, bro. Like, yeah. So you do, you, just like yeah. quarterback know where everybody's supposed to be, yeah. we got to know where these fat boys got to be. <laughs> yeah. We got to know where our partners got to be, because we got to know how we got to fit on these blocks. Thanks. And whatever yeah. block that's coming in this whole scheme of shit, because one side you might get on, you might have to box it. This other side, they come that way, you might have to spill it, because you might have to spill it to somebody over here. Yeah. Then you gotta know where your safety is. It's like at. a puzzle. You gotta know how it yeah. fits. Yeah. You know and what then saying? you gotta tell your safety to talk to you because whatever the coverage check and this, that, yeah, they gotta tell you some shit. Right. But mm -hmm. you gotta start telling yeah. these other people. Uh, that's a whole bunch of that's shit. That's why I, you heard what I said. I told him, hey, stay in his gap because if mm -hmm. he jumping gaps, to gap, we not, that's we, when, not yeah. we not, we not, we not playing together. Yeah. We not sound. Stay in your gap. Now, so I had a player that right. played in front of me that we jumped gaps when he was young. Hainsworth, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. It's like, look, man, you fucking this shit up. So <laughs> I would just tell him, man, don't play peekaboo. Peekaboo is when you, you go on one side and you go like that. Oh, you know I hate this. Yeah, that's you the Just worst. go one way that's and I'm going to go the other way. Yes. Right. And then he started, like, that's when he started yeah. catching wreck, like, shit. And then, you know, they had their games. He started, obviously, mm -hmm. mastering his skills, mastering mm -hmm. the games that he had to do within the D-line, understanding mm -hmm. how they was trying to block him and, mm -hmm. like, the whole technical shit that going to becoming a all-pro D-lineman. Yeah, but, yeah. but at first, man, let's get this regular shit together, got man. Right. Hey, you you got to get up in Oh, God. <laughs> Gotta learn the one on one. Let's do the regular, to. the normal shit first, cuz. <laughs> right. <laughs> now we talking all this football shit. Now as a football player, you after you play the game of football, you have a lot of extra time on your hands. Now me, I done did jujitsu and MMA and shit. But I saw something, bro. Were you over here curling? Yeah, man. <clears throat> like Curling? Yeah, he, like he, curling. Okay, okay, yeah. Okay, okay. yeah, yeah. So my man, um, Jared Allen, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So he yeah, lives, yeah. There's a lot of no. people, you know, y'all know a lot of people that didn't even do anything here, so like celebrities, athletes, mm. you know, yeah. live in Nashville. You know, yeah. he's one of them from, um, played at the Kansas City Chiefs, Minnesota yeah. Vikings. Yeah, yeah. dog. Defensive yeah. end, future Hall of Famer. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, man, his kids go, our kids go to the same school and he mm. had hit me up. Um, cause he, I guess he was driving through my neighborhood looking to buy something, you know, whatever. And he was like, yeah, man, um, you know, he started, I'm starting this curling team. You know, he got Mark <laughs> Bolger. Mark Bolger's the quarterback 
Uh, he played for the Rams mm -hmm. and he played for the Ravens. Uh, Mark Bolger, he lives in town too. You know what okay. I'm saying? And then, uh, and I actually like um, base just say when you retire, you kind of well when you stop playing, you you know start dabbling in other yeah, things. Definitely. I had an opportunity. I went to um, Toronto. My man was like, I can't pay you, but I could fly you up and put you up. And I was working on the Fantasy Broadcast Network. That's when DraftKings first came out. So we was doing a fantasy show like he was the um, you know, he was the moderator. There was an expert and then there was I'm the pro, you yeah. know, what I'm saying? Yeah. pro athlete. So it was a cool little situation. Um, but that saying, being said, the office party was curling. Oh, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> so he's like, have you ever curled? I'm like, uh, hey, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> uh, <laughs> hey, so, and then I was thinking we needed a fourth. I was thinking who we could get. And then my man Mike Ruse just recently retired, had just recently retired. So that was our fourth, man. We used to be in, um, so we would practice over there. I mean, Antioch. Um, mm -hmm. At the uh, Ford Ice Center, yeah, yeah. ice was trash, but you know it's <laughs> the best. Way. It wasn't curling ice, I should say. Obviously, yeah. it's gonna people are skating on it, so how good right, could it be? be yeah. But we would go up to Minnesota uh, every other week, and we would be at the Blaine Curling Center in Blaine, Minnesota, catch a little flight up there. We'll do like two a days, or we'll do two a days, um, stay over. And then do another two a days, boy. catch a nah, flight. Boy, nah, yeah. boy, nah, they not nah, like, 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 like play play. And then, and then yeah. COVID, uh, this ain't no hobby. Uniform, bro. Nah. yeah, co yeah, now nah, uniform all equipment. Like, yeah. Hey, we was getting, we was losing though. No, so no. it's like eight frames, eight nine frames, nine frames. Um, but like, <laughs> it's man, that shit is crazy. How you know precise and all that shit is. Right. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. It's like you be rocking, um, for the first like three to four frame, and then you just, them dudes is too nice with it. They right. got the endurance. They gonna hit yeah. the same spot every time and shit. Like, and yeah. it's like, base gotta put it somewhere, then you gotta put it somewhere, mm -hmm. and you gotta put it somewhere, and if it mess up, the, four, the fourth person gotta try and make that shit right. And that shit, right. yeah, it's tough. Mm. So right, we was you, out there loose. But would you yeah, say, did, us, would, would you say you had, this is an athletic sport? Yeah. Well, sure. well, I would say, if you're an athlete, you ain't gonna have a problem. You don't have to be athletic to do it. But if you if not athletic, you gonna get around and bust your ass on that ice. <laughs> I seen That's motherfuckers yeah. like yo, like to the point where it's like, oh shit, I hope she all right. Oh, like, no, oh yeah. damn. like slip and hit their head on oh, the stones, like I that type it. shit. Not, not the, the, like, they're not, they're not really it, paying attention because <laughs> like one shoe, with. one shoe is um real slippery. Like when you slide, okay. that's your slide shoe, so that's allowing you to slide, and you see your toe is pointed down. Yeah, so that has plastic on it, so. Is not it's creating good, friction yeah. and this one slides. So if you don't have that plastic um, sleeve over and you fucking around, all right, you go find Ooh. out. Right. What is it? Fuck, Fuck around, around and find, find out. out. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Yeah, nah, it's crazy. Oh, but yeah, it was shit. cool, man. Then COVID put a halt on it because we was traveling. We was going obviously Minnesota and then we would have um, bond spiels. That's what they call um, like when you go to the competitions and they would be, man, like definitely places where there's no black people. I'd be like the only <laughs> black person. A bond spiel? That's what it's called. That's it. Sound kind of always racist. It was spiel. cool though. It's a bond spiel like that. The, the he, actual, he said it again. <laughs> he the, the actual tournament is called the bond okay, spiel. Okay, yeah. And then after, but it was cool because after the the winners always buy the losers beers. So we used to drink mad beer. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. We used to get, yeah. used to get little, yeah. 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 Now, also, other than curling, you got your coffee, uh, Just Love Coffee down there what, on, on Music Row? Nah, I got one. There's one on Music it, Row, but I have got, my own shop um, out there. And they call it Fresh, Franklin, like Brentwood, Street. Franklin. Off McEwen yeah. by Whole Foods. Oh, yeah, that's Cool Spring. Yeah, yeah, that's Cool okay. Spring. Yeah, by you know Whole Foods. Oh, yeah, yeah. I know what that's about. Yeah. yeah. What's up? <clears throat> So what made you want to get into that in coffee? Um, uh, it's more, it's just, for me, it was a business play. You know what mm -hmm. I'm saying? Like, so when I played, like, I used to always go to the NFL, like, about my fifth year in the league. It was like, um, so many times you can go to Miami and, oh, yeah, you know, they do the, the thing. Yeah, 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 you know, the yeah, rotation, yeah. you know, yeah. Miami, Vegas, yeah. LA, Miami, Vegas, Bombers, yeah. like, you know what I'm yeah. saying? Um, <laughs> <laughs> shit, so, um, you know, I always knew that I've I span further than just being an athlete, and I was always, um, you know, at one point, like, how do I flip this cash I got? You know what I'm saying? So the NFL always offers these programs, like these two week programs at Wharton, Harvard, 
um, UPenn, and I, I just took all the motherfuckers. Mm-hmm. Stanford, you know what I mean? Just to kind of see how everybody, how the real world Work. thinking was yeah, going yeah, on yeah, out yeah. there. You know what I'm saying? So um, always been business oriented. I made a few investments. Um, you know, in friends, companies, because at one point, I'm, you know, my thing was like, shit, if I can give my homie an opportunity on an idea that he put a business plan to, um, gave it to my um, business advisor, financial advisor, vetted it, I like it, shit, it's cool, how much? Oh, word, what do I get, word? Okay, cool, nah, do your thing. And then now, like, 10 years later, the company's still thriving, mm-hmm. five, you know what I'm saying? Right, yeah. Yeah. And I'm just getting distributions, you know what I'm saying? So, like, I always... um believed in that and been like that. So when the draft came to Nashville, when it was like half a million people here and uh, people was hitting my phone bro. like, yo, oh, where can I go? With? And I'm telling them, yo, go here, go here, go here. And I'm like, oh, damn, how is the only thing I own is my house out there. I'm trying to tell you. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Not so uh, yeah. I wanted to, um, you know, invest in something local that gave back to a cause that kind of like, you know, gave back to a cause, you know, it was yeah. philanthropic because I had a foundation um, for under, for foster kids and underprivileged youth when I was here. So um, Just Love, the owner, he just started it, wanted to roast seeds to help families that wanted to adopt kids have the money because I guess it's an expensive process. Mm-hmm. Um, and I was in foster care, so it's like, okay, cool. I got a way that I could get back to the to to my cause, mm-hmm. you know, in an underlying way that it don't got to be, I ain't got to be all out, in the, you know mm-hmm. what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, yeah, so yeah. Um, it's cool. It's like um, gratifying in that sense. And then um, also learning the damn business is kind of crazy. Like um, over the last two and a half years, I learned a lot about food and best beverage, ownership, like anything you anything about owning and running, like yeah. I don't give a fuck if it's a damn burger stand. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's the same process, same operations, the it same is. things is gonna go into it. So it's like I could run anything now. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's like the Matrix. Like when you see them plug yeah. in, it's like yeah. teach them kung fu. It's like, <laughs> I'm plugged in. like two years is like learn yeah. how to run a motherfucking business. Like, goddamn. <laughs> Turf toe coming back. I'm up six and I'm mad at a motherfucker. <laughs> People ain't showing up. <laughs> but I know how to do that shit. <laughs> nah, it's live, though. It's, yeah. Especially, like, you know, um, back to your point, just, like, with the city. I mean, because, like, you've you been in Nashville now for... I mean, like, you, you started Nashville back in 2000. Yeah. Versus, like, where... I ain't like, bro, you might as well just say, you, you from Nashville. Yeah. I've been, I've been in Nashville <laughs> long. I, like, I've been... In Nashville, since like I'm, I'm 45, like I've been, I moved here when I was what 22. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I just turned yeah. 23. Your whole you know adult life, I mean? right? Yeah. Exactly. You know what I yeah. mean? So, Being yeah, I used to yo, lit, y'all talking about the limelight, man. All these places, man. My homies, they would have their high school reunions. And I'll be showing up at the high school reunions. My <laughs> homies right. from Nashville. Oh, okay. You know what I mean? Yeah, like, yeah. I went to like school around there, here. Yeah, like, you yeah. I'll be, yeah. be like, Kate, but like, what you doing here? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, Maybe I'll do your science class. Like, that's funny. Yeah. <laughs> that's live. That's, that's, that's live. Yeah, live. Sure. I got a question. So, like, you said earlier, like, uh, we were talking about, like, the socks and, like, using your vibe, getting, you know what I'm saying, getting to it. You know, he was, like, the Titans DJ for a little bit. So. Yeah. What was you listening to? So you from New York. I gotta yeah. know like what like what was in your headphones? What was in your C- CD player? Bro? <laughs> yeah, it was, it, it was CD it player. Was CD nah, player. we had, had a I had a pod. That's when the iPod. I think they just started to have the iPod. They did. They did have like, yeah, they maybe like two thousand. Yeah, big joint though. Nah, yeah. that shit was a break. Yeah, yeah, it was, it was a it was, like, it was like it was like one terabyte in the motherfucker like, though. It's small, yeah. yeah, yeah. No, you had different yeah, sizes, but I know what you're talking about. But I mean, like it right. was like right. that. It was, was big. Whole, it, it was only one color. It was silver. That so was like silver. <laughs> the way our locker room uh, was set up, like the, we had, you know, the linebackers. Then you had the DBs, and then you had the, um, you know, the D linemen. Um, so down on my end, I, yeah, I would run the music. I would have. We was. We was the tyrants, man. We was like, we was on that G unit shit, man. You know, Ooh, yeah, but, yeah, like, yeah, just, yeah, like, yeah. We was on that, we was on like G unit. We was on like that's when like all that like uh, beanie shit. Like I was I bring my East Coast shit oh, yeah, in, you yeah, know yeah, what I'm yeah, saying? Okay, like, yeah. but then like obviously, like, you know, TI, 
You know, we was on that, and then anything in the South that was going on, like that shit that they doing now, that who running shit, that was going on when we was going. Hell like, we yeah, used to do that shit. Yeah, like, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, this, this right um, up, up the street. Like, anything in this, you know what I'm saying? Anything that was going on, um, you know, in the South back then, and then even in Houston. Houston was going off too, Lil Flip, all that shit. Mm-hmm. Like, yeah. Yeah. Paul Wall, yeah. Paul Wall, 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 Paul being in the league a few years, like I had been to these places and picked up these Pick, different yeah, sounds yeah, and shit. Yeah, yeah. You know that's what I'm what saying? Yeah. The West Coast, spent yeah. a lot of time on the West Coast because that's when, um, that's where I trained. That's where my agent mm-hmm. was at. You know okay. what I'm saying? It's, okay. cold. it's cold in New York, but yeah. it's just like this. Like in yeah. January, February in the off season, take my ass to Cali. Yeah. Get out there, run, chill, yeah. you yeah. know what I'm saying? Do what I do. Yeah, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Got to. So, got right. to. Yeah, Cali. Yeah, that's that's my space. That's right. Hey, that's so, what I yeah, now nah, all of that. San Diego, like, bitch. Yeah. So San I had Diego. a good mix. Look, like definitely like um Genuinely, though, had, had, yeah, had a Yeah, nah, run like again, that was hey, like yeah, that was yeah. like when I like, you know, our first little I played like a good three good lows. I played it ten years. So when I first got here, it was them them dudes that like the Music City Miracle crew. I got to catch a vibe with mm-hmm. yeah. and then the vibe that me and my boy recreate like me, uh, you know, Tank Whip, uh, Samari Roll, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hainsworth, you know, we did that. Then McNair was still here, you know what I'm saying? We had another good run, you know what I'm saying? And then, um, you know, when Chris Johnson and Vince Young and all them was here too, you know, we had some good runs then, playoffs, won 10 in a row and stuff like that. So, you know, the music has carried, I would say like the last few years, definitely was like heavy Houston, Jeezy, Definitely Jeezy for sure. Hey, that might be Jeezy for sure. Oh, yeah, yeah. Right. yeah. Right. yeah. yeah. Um, yeah. Shit, yeah. Ross, when Ross came out, that whole, yeah. you know, obviously Wayne, yeah. who I'm tripping, you know, Wayne. Yeah, that's, that's but like, like, I'm older, yeah, like I say, yeah. so like, Jay-Z is really what I came up on, yeah. you know what I mean? Damn. Pac, you know yeah. what I'm saying? So, like I say, man, I'm touching every everywhere, you know what I'm when saying? When you run a music locker room, you got to be able to touch it. Everywhere. Yeah, everywhere, yeah, because to. not everybody want to listen to what it's I want to hear. Right, right, right. Right. And I'm going to hit you after practice. I'm going to hit you with some R&B so we can chill out, exactly. man. We got yeah. chill the nerves, man. Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, R&B, maybe some, some, some John Coltrane, yeah. something yeah. to like, you know, okay. like, right. get the shit right. Yeah, yeah. you know. Saturday, maybe. Yeah, after yeah. a long That's practice. So after practice, we used to... um. Back when I was back, you can go back in the, in the equipment room. They used to have like a whole refrigerator just full of beer. They still got that yeah. shit, bro. Oh, word. That's Everybody what's up. still got that. Yeah, we used to go back there and like, you ain't getting drunk, but like, nigga, you, you just, just out there going hard. Still, you gonna drink yeah. a couple brews, you know what I'm saying? And a Gatorade yeah. and go out, take a shower and do what you do. Mike said, brews, then a Gatorade. <laughs> right. <laughs> hey, you gonna drink that Gatorade when you get in that meeting. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Let me get right real quick. <laughs> now, sweet, I saw you. Uh, you said House of Dragon. The, the, what yeah. happened though? Said House it was of Dragon is mid. Oh, we talking about TV? Yeah, yeah, that, yeah. I, yeah, I said it, it was mid. I said it. it right, was right. Mid. You said it House was, of Dragon. They just building up. You it's know? mid. Yeah, and like it was. I, I believe. I didn't like, like the, the ending though. I did not like the ending. So I'm on episode ten now. Oh, but well, I mean, you, you can. Swear. I don't care. You can spoil. Nah, it. I'm, I'm not, not gonna say nothing. I'm gonna just let you watch it. I'm not. I'm not even investing in this point. I'm gonna just let you watch it. Just because it's like, I mean, yeah, I'm gonna just it. let you watch it. And then yeah. if you feel like that, yeah. then you're gonna feel like the ending. Like, it's word. me because I forgot even what happened. <laughs> For real? That's so what I'm saying. I you you already saw it? Nah, it's cool, right. but yeah. I think next season, based the way it ended, <laughs> yeah. next season is got, they gotta turn up they next turn season. Up next they, season. Yeah, they yeah. gotta turn it's up next season. season. Yeah, I would just like, I, so like my, my new thing now is I don't watch shows, everybody else watching. It's like my new shit. Yeah, trying to be like some Joe Budden and shit, nigga. Huh? I mean, but really, you know, it makes sense now. Like, now I, I ain't got to be rushed. I can watch them all the time. Facts. Ain't nobody talking about it no more on Twitter and shit. Yeah. <laughs> None of that. I'm That's just watching funny. it. Unbiased. Hold on, yeah. what the fuck is Pepsi? Where, where's my jet? Do what? Pepsi, where's my jet? It's a new movie. Oh. Pepsi, where's my jet? What's it about? Yeah, what the fuck? Right, so I have not seen Dude, where's my car? <laughs> That's what I thought. That's what I thought. Pepsi started doing these promotions where, like, they're trying to keep up with Coke, so they started doing like a little catalog, throw the Pepsi shirts, and oh. hats, whatever, and then at the end of this little ad, it had like a jet, and it said like for seven million points, whatever. Oh and shit! Oh, my like, All right, damn, I can do this. And then he gets an investor. 
kind of help them do this, and then they like what? go at this kind of impossible goal. What? And then they, yeah, they kind of start a war with Pepsi. What? And they got it. He reached the goal. Uh, I don't have him finished. Alright, I'm on it. I'm on it. What the hell? Run me my jet. Hold on, hey, hold on. Give me that jet, motherfucker. What the fuck you think you finna do with a jet? It don't matter. Hey, I'm gonna flip this hoe. I'm gonna flip this hoe. Okay. Alright. Flip that bitch. The number to figure out that like he can get this jet for like we'll say 4 million dollars. Yeah. Is what we're regular person. Wow. Ridiculous, but right. The jet's worth about $32 million. Shit. Yeah, we're talking about what you're going to do. Flip that, hoe. Yeah. Shit. Flip that. Oh, yeah. Bro, where's 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 my advertising. jet? Speaking of advertising, have you seen the uh, the uh, Crystal commercials? Crystal. Yeah. Crystal. The side chick. The side chick. Oh, my God. Oh, oh, hey, yeah. That is the wildest. I, I was driving by that shit. hole that seemed like something about the side chick. The wildest shit. That's so funny. It's funny, It's funny as hell. But, like, yo, it's a link that advertising has got this far. It is Brittany Riller. Yes, bro. It's slick genius, though, fool. It's slick genius. It is. Think about that. Hold on. Chris was back like that. Right, fool. And then, like, she say, you can keep your bag thing. We just want to be a side chick. I don't know why. That's crazy. That's crazy. It's crazy. <laughs> Advertising it went. It catched the eye. Yeah. They say whatever, they whatever now, yo. It went over, went. bro. Off I'm driving on 40. I'm driving, was it 40 and 65? She on the billboard. Side chicks. It say <laughs> whatever. That's on the side, crazy. bro. Do you ever go back to Syracuse? Like to football nah, game? man. No. They had us back in 2017 um, celebrating um, the teams that won the three um, championships in a row. Mm -hmm. And we said we was going to start going, picking a game, but then COVID happened. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Kind of slowed it down. Up. And then I was going to go this year. COVID happened. Then I got my shop. I started doing, you know what I'm saying? So like I was going to go this year, but to the, I think it was the Purdue game because then I was going to drive up to Buffalo and go mm -hmm. to the Titans Monday night okay. game. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But, I was like, man, forget that. <laughs> 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 nah, I think some came up, but it's like, man, forget it. But nah, my school, y'all was work. talking about y'all schools. <laughs> yeah. We 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 started off six and zero. We got like we was ranked like top oh, fourteen, yeah, 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 and then we lost our last five. We six God, and five. Damn. Sweet. So he said it ain't gonna be no food. They ain't gonna pull up. Yeah, I'm cool. Ain't gonna be no food. They ain't gonna pull up. I'm cool. He's talking about the Absolutely building. Absolutely not. <laughs> that building is sad as hell. You six and zero, now you. Up. Oh, you lost your... Yeah, that's Bruh, crazy, the, uh, the same thing happened to my Tigers, fool. Like, we started off four... Nah, we started off... Oh, the football team? Four and one, I want to say. Yeah. Drop five straight. I'm like, God. <laughs> Not even Bo Elgin. Ah, you know. Really? Nah, y'all did. I did see I seen we? earlier. They said they both. Really? Yeah, it'll be all right, though, man. Y'all been Drop like, five. Now. <laughs> Look at these. Y'all ain't been cold like that ever. Anyway. Well, shit. Huh? Yeah, uh, we bowl as the bro, we, we, uh, we, Them we, boys we, got their bowl, and like, like, we hey. good. <laughs> man, hey, the fool. Now, we just started this new thing over here. What um, you got, man? The Raw Room email. All right. People send their shit in. We had one. Uh, first of all, I'm going to read it because I want this nigga to know. I seen your shit, nigga. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Bob Store. He was like, when y'all gonna get that Wooster? Now, Wooster is a chicken sandwich. My boy got a uh, a food truck. He be selling you no know, late nights, trapping them chickens at 12 a.m. in Nashville. You know Where's that? Where is that? He be yeah, everywhere. Like, he be all up on DeMarver and he'll be over. Uh, What's the name Kung of his food? truck? I don't even be out that late like that no more, though. Oh, um, right, shit. Let me go his show and shit. Right. <laughs> yeah, like, fuck. Yeah, <laughs> that nigga be out here late nights. I may do it this, this Saturday, though. Saturday, I may be outside. Yeah, FBI. Uh, I am. Come on. What's know. this Wooster? Come on. Uh, he said it was. He said it was. It was a chicken. Right, we just gonna put it on the. Oh. He tag us and everything. He always put us on his uh, on his uh, IG stories and shit. But uh, we're basically yeah. trying to get outside this, this, this weekend. Don't anyway. Man, right, first of all, it's Nashville, bro. What you mean? No, I don't be going out here like that. It's okay, bro. Come, come, kick with me for one night. <laughs> Man, you be getting out the house at seven thirty. Absolutely. It's a great time to get out, right? Yeah, okay, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm going to be home early. I'm, I'm more of a 9, 30, 11 something. You know what I'm saying? That's it's a great time to get out, right? He said, yeah, Been around yeah. seat. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> hey, I ain't trying to be out all night no more. He said, dinner around seat. He said, hell yeah. Yeah, dinner around nah, seat. Right, right, nah, nah, dinner about 7.30. No, okay, yeah, okay, yeah, dinner around 7.30. 6, 7.30. All right, right, now we got he one last thing. He said 6, 7.30. That's an hour and a half fucking window. Right. 
Hey, what the hell, sweet? Hey, go for that. Hell, nah. I feel you, though. Now, <laughs> before we get out of here, I do, we had this thing. We haven't done this in a long time. Pay, tag, cut. We oh, pay one thing, you tag one thing, like you cut another. Cut. Now, we're going to get to some Syracuse legends on this pay, tag, cut. Ooh, uh, we didn't talked them. about this young fella on this podcast before. He played with, him, with, uh, with a guy that's a UT uh, a volunteer and, and uh, you know, Bronze Slade. Yeah, Bronze Slade. I was like, fuck you. I was about to say Ramon Foster. Foster. And I was like, hold on. Yeah, no, 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 no. Big Slade dog. That's my dog. Yeah, Big Slade. Now, Slade was over here telling some Big Carmelo Slade. Anthony stories. Uh, that's a, a fucking legend if everybody, obviously. Dwight Freeney, Donovan McNabb. You got to pay one, you got to tag one, you got to cut one. It don't matter what it is. Pay, tag, cut. Carmelo Anthony, Dwight Freeney, Donovan McNabb. I'm a... <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna pay. I'm gonna pay Melo because he brought the natty. Yeah. yeah. Okay. That too. Yeah. I'm gonna pay free because he's a defensive player. Yeah. And I'm gonna cut Nab because that's just my man, and I could do that. <laughs> 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 He'll be alright. He'll be alright. <laughs> that real. Hey, that's all right there. Man, that was was Melo was some serious. Yeah, man, brought home a natty, man. Melo. Melo I don't think about Melo the other day for some odd reason. Free was something that's serious, bro. Yeah. <laughs> well, he the first one to do the face spin. Oh my yeah, god. Yeah, he was. He was. He was. I played with him in consistently. His like last it was his. It was. Years. He patented it. Yeah. That was like his one. That was his go to for the sure. Spin was man, when I saw that shit, I thought that was the most amazing thing in the world. But that might mid. You do yeah. it. Yeah. Sack. God damn. I'm talking about, I was in, on, on the iPads run. That shit back and forth. Like, bro, how the fuck <laughs> you get your feet to do that? <laughs> Coordinate with your hips and your arms and your body. Well, to... they're playing basketball, man. But yeah, man. Y'all got anything before we get up out of here? I ain't got time. Nah. Nah, I think we good, man. Phone, yeah. Go to Welcome back, y'all. We back in yeah, the studio. Yeah, we studio. back in Hold back on, first of all. Yes, uh, uh, YouTube. Listen. You all you YouTube subscribers out there, look, we appreciate y'all. Mm-hmm. Y'all motherfuckers in these comments talking crazy about me. <laughs> <laughs> I laugh at that shit. All right, keep it up. I appreciate it. Yeah. I think it's fun. It's hilarious. It's gonna keep me going. I get on here, I be even more funny when you say I'm not fun. <laughs> 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 I'm gonna tell you, you're not my hater. You're my motivator, and I appreciate you. And listen, we about to re up on all this merch out here. Finally. Uh yeah, we back. We finally uh, legit. Yes, sir. You know what I'm saying? We were working dirty for a little man. Yeah. We legit, too legit to quit. Now we back. We got to track. drop a whole bunch of bunch of heat. It's gonna be the same heat because why not keep the classes in motion? You gotta keep the classes. Might add some hoodies in there. Put some, some new uh, shit too. Some, you know what I'm saying? Some joggers in there. But it's mm-hmm. gonna be some some. Mm-hmm. It's gonna it's gonna it's gonna it's gonna get your juices flowing. Where, where can we find you at on uh, social media? <laughs> on Twitter is um, at cable fifty three. And on Instagram, it's um, my name, Keith Bullock, B-U-L-L-U-C-K, 53. That's it. Hold on, but why you? Why won't we click on the link on your thing? Yeah, man, it just went straight to Japan on me. <laughs> it went where? Somebody to didn't Japan. hack you. Hack click, your wheel, click it see, I'm not pressing it. He said, I'm not pressing it. Bruh, that's just, that's just how I'm going to get my phone a virus I click on that link. <laughs> on my Instagram? <laughs> nah, on your, on your, on your Twitter, Twitter. The link on your page. Hello, I'm about to show you. <laughs> phone, your sweet, your there. phone gonna shut down. I said, do not Man, click on that shit. I should have clicked on it. Right? Your, your phone gonna shut down, sweet. Uh, my web page. What? I just probably won't even load this time. Oh, we. It, it, it's, it's already doing the weird stuff. It just popped up. Oh, ah, the sixes nah. and the nine. Oh, hell no. Nah. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, man, you know what? I got to get them to take this shit down. <laughs> <laughs> I got to. I, 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 I don't wear my social, social, social media. Social media. Uh, I don't uh, know what's going on. I did have a um, web page. Somebody must have took that hey, shit. Yeah, they stole yeah, shit. Man. Oh, well, I ain't shit. tripping. I don't care about that shit no way. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so yeah, y'all go follow us. If you ain't subscribed, get subscribed. Go hit them like buttons. Me time. Um, Y'all see, like I said, we running it up, so it's on way is to keep on going up. And uh, shit, anybody got something back there? You good? Y'all good? Shit, y'all already know what it is. Mm. If you have something to say and need a place to help you say it, check out the boys at the Raw Room Media Group to get information on recording the session. Appreciate y'all for listening. Hey, follow us. Follow us at the Raw Room, Twitter, Instagram. Follow me at Wesson underscore Sun 56 on Instagram, on Twitter, DB underscore 5 Trey. Follow your boy, JC, 
uh, jcar underscore 11, Twitter, uh, Instagram, jcar underscore 32. Uh, and the, the raw room is at raw underscore underscore room. Roomies, we appreciate y'all for listening. Yeah. We'll tune in for you next week. Easy. Easy. Easy.